my Easter poem titled Life Resurrected. Spring does bring regeneration as nature calls forth for birth and growth and new life cycles begin and reminds us of a life once lived as love incarnate that transcended death around to life again. I honor and celebrate that life example greatly given some few short millennia ago, preserved and anchored into the grid so as to know what the spirit of humanity would one day show. Regeneration, resurrection, recreation, and unlimited, beautiful, and creative forms of life being born happens in the empty, receptive space following death, dissolution, and all attachments being shorn. Cracking the shell and melting the hardness, breaking through and opening space to let and to allow the most heavenly and finest frequencies of love and life existing in the moment eternally here now can begin once again to move right in, set up shop, become comfortable and make a home in the mind. Gently infiltrating dissonant patterns and perceptions until the spirit of creation is all the mind can find. As nature very gracefully shows, to release, dissolve, and surrender, clears the path and calls into play the spirit of resurrection, fueled by creator's love for life's abundance to come forth and repave the way. Rich, full, and vibrant, love surrounds and soaks into the self, and life is seen again, yet with new eyes. Separated senses of self fall away, revealing the wonderful one within as powerful, loving, and wise. Potently present, perfectly aware, peacefully perceiving, being and existing in the patterns of perfection, a journey of ever ascending heights of interconnective perspective, repainting the canvas of perception, undulating waves of joyful reveling in the matrix of the mystery and knowing I am in the shared creation. Kinetic, colorful, coordinated molecules of love, dancing, ecstatic concerts of harmony and elation. Another blessed soul awakens, and the divine intelligence of nature surges forward in following her plan. Infinitely resourceful, wholly committed and ceaselessly working towards the conscious evolution of man. <laughs>